categorical distribution, describes the probabilities for a discrete random variable, to take on different categories, or states. We will now consider an example of a case, where we can use this distribution, to describe the probabilities of different events. Consider a bag, with 5 blue, 4 red, and 3 yellow balls. Let's say we want the probabilities of the color, after drawing a single ball from this bag at random. Our sample space, will have 3 different outcomes. The ball will either be blue, red, or yellow. It is also important to note, that since we are dealing with the categories of the colors, expected value, or variance, have no sense here. Let's now parametrize this categorical distribution, using a vector p. We will have the first element of this vector, describe the probability of the outcome to be blue. Since we have a total of 12 balls, out of which 5 are blue. The first element will be equal to 5 twelfths. We will have the second element, describe the probability of drawing a red ball. Following the same logic as before. The second element of vector p, will be equal to 4 twelfths. We know, that the sum of the probabilities of a discrete random variable, must be equal to 1. Hence, the probability of the drawn ball to be yellow, will be given by 1, minus the sum of elements in the vector. Essentially, categorical distribution, can be used to describe the probabilities of discrete outcomes, such as color.